A Simpson gear set is the most common of the two popular planetary gear sets and is used in many three-speed transmissions. It features a common sun gear and two separate planetary carriers and ring gears. Gear ratios and direction of rotation are the result of applying torque to one member of either of the planetary units, holding at least one member of the gear set and using another member as the output. In neutral, engine torque is sent by the transmission's input shaft to the planetary gear set. No member of the gear set is locked to the input shaft, so no movement results. In first gear, the input shaft is locked to the front planetary ring gear that turns clockwise with the shaft. The front ring gear drives the front planet gears in a clockwise direction, which in turn drives the sun gear in a counterclockwise direction. These planet gears drive the ring gear that is locked to the output shaft. The rear planet carrier is locked, therefore the sun gear spins the rear planet gears in a clockwise direction. The result is a power flow that is a forward gear reduction. In second gear, the input shaft is locked to the front ring gear that turns clockwise with the shaft. The front ring gear drives the front planet gears clockwise. The front planet gears walk around the sun gear because it is held. This forces the planet carrier to turn clockwise. The carrier is locked to the output shaft, and the result is a forward direction with gear reduction. In third gear, the input is received by the front ring gear as in other forward positions. The sun gear also receives the input. As the ring gear and the sun gear are rotating in the same direction and at the same speed, the planet carrier, which is the output, is locked between the two. The output rotation is equal to the input rotation and direct drive results. In reverse, the sun gear receives the input from the transmission input shaft and it rotates in a clockwise direction. The sun gear then drives the rear planet gears in a counterclockwise direction. The rear planet carrier is held, therefore the planet gears drive the rear ring gear in a counterclockwise direction. The ring gear is locked to the output shaft and turns at the same speed and direction as the rear ring gear. The result is a reverse gear with gear reduction.